This is the grave of Lucinda Chaffins Hess. She was born in Virginia in 1856 to parents Nathaniel and Polly. She's buried immediately next to one of her siblings, an elder brother James, who was three years her senior and died at the age of 11 in 1856. Now, Lucinda had a very interesting childhood um, and she was living around the Civil War uh, with all the fighting around her home in West Virginia. Um, her father, Nathaniel, served in the war for the Union Army, um, but was injured and given a military medical discharge. But when he returned home, he was actually taken prisoner by the Confederate Army, along with his father-in-law. Now, Lucinda's grandmother didn't like that at all, and she set up a laundry business for the Confederate officers that were holding her husband and her son-in-law prisoners, uh, but she used that as an excuse to bring them food. So every day she would go through and bring food to them, um, just walking through the gates with food to feed her family. After Lucinda's father and grandfather were released from the prison camp, uh, the family moved west to Minnesota. This is where Lucinda met her husband, Thomas. Together they had three children, Earl, Thomas Jr., and Mary. Ultimately, Lucinda died from complications of childbirth when she was giving birth to Mary. She died two days after Mary was born. Mary did live a long life till the age of 80 and had a family of her own. Lucinda's husband, Thomas Sr., remarried a year after Lucinda's death to Martha Tupper in 1888. Together, Thomas and Martha had another seven children for a total of 10 for Thomas Sr.